Ball popped up, should do it. Chasen will camp underneath it. He'll make the catch. He'll make the, the wild fashion, 13 to 10. And they celebrate on the hill. Your way into the tournament, and this team got hot. Yeah, it was amazing. We were one and five at one point. We needed to essentially win out the last week to get in the tournament. But, you know, the guys never gave up. We kept fighting. Things started coming together. We got, you know, good pitching, and our defense really stepped up, too. And I tell you, there's such a great bunch of guys. There's, they never, never quit. We had a lot of adversity in this game. We blew two, four, five run leads. But these guys, I had a lot of faith in them. I knew when we come back in the dugout, we were still alive that we were going to battle. Yeah. What do you say in the dugout when you're taking a look at that scoreboard and those numbers rising on both sides like the temperature? Yeah, you know, I, I joked with our pitcher, Caleb Spielman, who was, you know, gave one run going into the seventh. I go, geez, Caleb, what happened to the game? <laughs> I was joking with him, but he pitched phenomenally. Then things just got out of control a little bit, and both teams, uh, you know, got deep into the bullpens. But... You know, finally we were able to just uh, clamp down a little bit more and and uh, get the last couple outs. The satisfaction of winning a, a state championship at this level? Unbelievable. Unbelievable for our program. I mean, our, uh, this Ellington Summers program is a program that's been growing the last few years. And guys like our general manager, Heath Kidd, 15 new coach, Chris Matei, and the great staff here with Kerr Holmes and Tom McAloosa. We've really you know, built something special. We didn't imagine this, but, uh, you know, this is unbelievable. I'm so happy for the guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thomas. Caleb, obviously, a yeah, great performance out there. I mean, you left and looked like you had this thing wrapped up, and all of a sudden the floodgates opened up and it turned into just a crazy game. Uh, but congratulations on a state championship. How's it feel? Thank you. It feels good. Well, you know, good we just we fought all game. Um, it was just wonderful coming back. No one expected us to number 10 seed, went 11 and 10 the regular season to come out here and win. And we just showed that how much fight we have and how much we come together as a team. What goes to the mind of a ball player when you watch that scoreboard and you can't get that final out? Uh, more baseball, you know? You, you get excited for more baseball to play. So it was a good, it was uh, sour, but it was a good feeling, though. It was good. How about when the final catch was made at the shortstop spot? It was unbelievable, unbelievable. It felt so good. What did you learn from this season as a team and as, a, as an individual? Uh, just how great it is when the team plays together. At the beginning of the year, we started one and five, and we weren't playing together. Together. And then we just we started having team get-togethers and getting closer, and our chemistry just went way through the roof, and that's what we just connected. So you, you had to play a lot of different positions today. It was kind of a crazy game. You, you win the Most Valuable Player Award. We know it's a team game, but uh, you gave such a great effort out there. You know, when your name was announced as the guy that uh, was most valuable, what went through your mind? I was kind of shocked. Like, I started the season not playing too well, and then I started picking it up at the end. And I was playing great throughout the playoffs, so it felt good to be rewarded, you know. But let's talk a little bit about playing baseball, American Legion baseball, and what it means to you. Is it, is it special to you? Uh, I don't really know if it means anything to me, but it's just really fun and really special to play with a group of guys like this. I mean, in the end of the day, we're like one big family, and coming and winning this state, state title meant a lot to us. What was the turnaround when you were one and five? What turned it around for you guys? Uh, I, we just decided we were tired of losing and wanted to win. I don't really know what else. It's a lot more fun, right? Oh, absolutely. It's way more fun. Pass a dive of the third baseman, Holmes, and in the left field, and the bases are now loaded. A little From the stretch, the 1-1. One, one. Ball popped up, should do it. Chasen will camp underneath it. He'll make the catch. He'll make the wild fashion 13 to 10 and they celebrate on the hill.